in the process of supplying temporary shelter, winterized shelter, uh, especially in the form of prefabricated housing units. And uh, hundreds of these units were already deployed in several parts of Ukraine, especially those that have high numbers of internally displaced people. is uh, energy, energy-related assistance like generators, repair kits for electricity grids, transformers, substations, and all these you know, very technical items that Ukraine needs in order to repair the damage that the Russian attacks have uh, done to critical civilian infrastructure. We have already been able to supply Ukraine by 500 with 500 generators and we will try to do more 500 generators were supplied through the civil protection mechanism additional 300 were funded through the humanitarian aid but of course much more is needed in view of the damage that is being done encouraging member states to put in place enough resources to face this kind of uh, increased needs that can be that can also arise in EU member states themselves because one cannot exclude additional uh, refugee inflow due to the harsh uh, conditions in Ukraine uh, that, that are coming up for this, this winter.